What's good, STG family? It's your girl Simba, Simba the God, Simba the Greatest, Simba the Don. And today, I'm going to be doing a video to help my fellow man when it comes to this headset and the Elgato and getting party chat. Okay, so look, 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 look. I made a video a while ago. When I made that video, that video was for a friend. I wasn't really trying to, like, how do you put it? Like, make the video get as many views as it did but I had a lot of people in the comments telling me oh it's still not working or this isn't informative enough like bro listen I was not trying to you know get as many views it was just like a one time video so he has something to watch and set it up because I convinced somebody to buy it so I'm gonna just redo the video for y'all because I know I left out a crucial step so I'm gonna redo the video for y'all here right now this is this is where everything that's coming out i'm gonna explain it please follow it to the t i'm gonna still i'm gonna leave my discord link but follow it to the t and that you should not have any problems so this right here this is the headset this is right here okay now this this is aux value now when this is not plugged directly into your pc for the power source you won't hear pc volume unless you have the aux down here plugged into your computer so i have this right here you know so i do it just when i'm using the headset but when i'm just using my computer i use the speaker so right now it's not plugged in but you would plug it in and you would hear pc volume and you'd hear game volume at the same time that's for people that want to hear their alerts and things like that that's for like pc volume if this is not plugged into your pc okay so let's go back here do a little different for y'all all right, so this right here is your power supply. Your power supply, where you plug it in is important. If you wanna use that headset as a microphone on your Xbox, this must be plugged into your Xbox. If you wanna use the headset as a microphone for your PC, this must be plugged into your PC, okay? That is mandatory. It, it, all, it really depends on where you plug this in at. So from the back of here, Mine is in my Xbox. That's where you would hear party chat at. So I have this plugged into my Xbox. Of course, it's in PC mode. It tells you, you know, when to put it in. I mean, it's it's in console mode. It tells you when to put it in PC and console mode. Now this here, this is very important. This is the stream output. Okay. Now this goes directly into your Elgato. I'll show you where it's going in at. This right here is just an extra piece. Because with all this stuff plugged in, it tends to create a buzzing noise because there's so much power going through everything. You'll hear a buzz on your stream. This just takes away that buzzing noise. It's like $8 on Amazon. I'll drop the link below if you want it. But that's what that is. But if it, if it wasn't there, it'd just be a regular aux cord. It's just going through this. So I'm going to show you where the stream output is going. Hold on. Excuse me, puppy. So that stream output that I just pointed at. Is going into right here on the Elgato that is the the end part of the Elgato okay so from stream to the uh, the in input part now this this part right here is coming from the back of my Xbox okay so that this from in to the Xbox out to the monitor and this is plugged in into the computer so it gets its power right so that's everything there but you just you have to make sure when you trying to get the the part set you have to make sure this part is plugged into the stream part right there okay now let's go back all right this is the optical cable you know this you know this has to be if you're using this for like pc stuff don't worry about it but if you're using this for an xbox or a console this has to be plugged into your back end console so this is plugged into my xbox over there now here's where it gets tricky so if if everything is plugged up correctly like this you should have no problems so let's go back so when everything is plugged up there's still one more step that needs to be done we're gonna go right here oh turn that cam off because i don't want you to see me all right so you see how i have my elgato labeled on my OBS. It's all it's in the same on regular OBS, Streamlabs OBS, anything. You right click, 
this one right here, right click on it, and that'll pop up. And then you hit properties. When you hit properties, it'll pop up like this. It'll do the same regular OBS. You hit configure window. Now when you hit configure window, this pops up at the bottom. Now when this pops up, you click it. It came over to this screen. This is your Elgato settings. You have to make sure you have this clicked on with analog audio. That is the, your, your, that's, so at this point, when you don't have this on, the, the volume will come from just the HDMI cord. You don't get, you know, you don't get um, party chat that way. You have to have it with analog audio because it's picking up what's going through your Astro Mix amp. So you have that on. Um, now I do suggest, once you, well, once you have that on, just click done. But what I suggest is once you have that on is to play with the audio because sometimes it'll like the game volume or sound too slow, but people will be still talking loud. So I played with this a little bit. I can show you my settings. So this is my, my Elgato settings, like when you open it, because there's three different ways to change the volume on this. So this is my Elgato settings, the decibels, and then when you change it, the value of volume is 76. So, but I go by decibels, so that's what that is on. My game volume on the uh, OBS is negative 5 points, negative 5.8, I'm sorry. And then, um, hold on, give me a second. All right, so this is basically my settings right here. Um, this must be up, not all the way. Like this is how I figured. Like you can still hear the game audio in the chat, so make sure y'all, you know, y'all can play with it however it sounds best for you. But this is what I got. Uh, microphone. That's not needed. Um, like it's it's just not needed. Like if you turn this up, and you already use a microphone, they'll hear it twice. They'll hear you. And then they'll hear they hear you from like your microphone, and then they'll hear you talking into your headset. So that's no need to be on. And like if if you were to do it like this, and you don't want to use a microphone, you want to use that. I would suggest to just plug it into your computer because this will be delayed unless you have a HD sixty Pro. Like regular Elgato's, if you you know play the video games on there, you'll realize your gameplay is delayed before your camera is. So I would just. You know, all all chat will your your webcam will be current to you, but this will be delayed with the gameplay. So I wouldn't suggest using this. Just plug it in if you're gonna if you want to use it. Um. Now aux, the only way I would turn this up is if you're plugging your aux cord into something else. So say like the music you want to play music, but from your phone, you can plug that in this aux right here into your phone, and then you'll turn this up and they can hear it. Cause they won't hear it twice but if you're going if you're playing music off your computer i wouldn't suggest it just for the simple fact that you have a desktop audio that they can hear so if you put if you're if this is plugged into your computer and you put this up and this up they're hearing the music twice you see what i'm saying so there's no point these are the main three things you need as long as it's not you know as long as you're not using this as your um your uh, stream you know using your headset as your stream microphone okay but that's my settings um if you want to see any of these settings this is what mine is too my default mode is console mode because i use my headset for my console like i talk to people through my microphone when i talk into the stream so there's no point of me using pc mode unless i'm trying to change any of the settings but other than that yeah man that that's pretty much it so just try it out, you know what I'm saying? Now, listen, before you come in my comments, you know, angry and upset about everything, I don't, I don't know why, but y'all just come in my comments being angry. I literally told you, if you have a question, you can definitely come ask. You can hit me up on my social medias and I will help you any be the best way I can to get it done. So hit me up if you still have a problem. Discord is open. My Twitter DMs, I, I answer them. Instagram DMs, I answer them. We can link up on Discord and I can legit show you how to get it done. So just ask me, you know, and we can try it out, you know, help you as best as I can. But other than that, man, that's pretty much it. So I'm, I'm going to just do a quick rundown again. This, 
Now this was only, I changed this to so I can plug it in my computer so I don't have to unplug it from my Xbox. But this, into your Xbox. This, from the stream output, into your Elgato. There's an aux cord port. This, into your Xbox. This is your headset. This, into your computer. Okay? And then make sure it's in console mode. So it'll be red. Okay? And then just make sure this one setting is on. Make sure that analog audio is on. And just fiddle fiddle with the uh, the sound settings as you wish. But, yeah, that's pretty much it, man. Y'all make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications, everything like that. I appreciate you tuning in. And, uh, like I said earlier, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask. Sim to God, Sim the Greatest, Sim to Don, and I am out, STG family. I love y'all. Peace.